So my motivational moment is a quote from a coach that I worked for in the 2004 Olympic Games. His name is Radko Rudich, and he was known for sort of being a very almost grueling in the sort of training that he would put his teams through in the, in the name of team building and cohesion. And so he took a very inexperienced American national team over in, in the year 2000 and proceeded to put them through an extremely grueling training program with an eight-year goal of winning a gold medal. And I was lucky enough to join him in 2003. And at that time, in preparation for the 2004 Olympic Games, the training was absolutely unlike anything that I've ever imagined or experienced in my life. Eight, 10 hours a day, and it was just absolutely grueling is just that the word that just kind of describes it the best but uh, he kind of also had a knack for motivational speeches kind of in, in moments where the players really sort of maybe needed it most and one of the quotes that stuck out in my mind from him was sort of in reference to taking a very inexperienced team on this stretch goal of winning a gold medal in 2008 and the kind of training and work and sacrifice and everything that was required in order to do that was there is no other way and so that really kind of stuck with me because it kind of summed up really everything that needed to be done in, in, in order to reach a, a goal that seems outlandish or something that maybe people think that can't be accomplished, you know, especially with an inexperienced team. So if anybody thought that we were going to achieve the goal of winning the gold medal in 2008 without an extreme level of sacrifice, an extreme level of commitment, extreme level of, of training, they were mistaken. And that really hit home with me that there's just no other way if you're trying to do something special you need special work you need ex extraordinary work you need extraordinary sacrifice to that effect in 2008 the national team won the silver medal and that was without Radko Rudic who left after 2004 but the majority of those players continued on with the lessons they had learned from that period from 2000 to 2004 and and achieved uh, an incredible goal